June is National Cancer Survivor Month, and two-time Olympic gold medalist Shannon Miller captured the hearts of Americans. But at 33 years young, Shannon found herself facing far more serious rival than the balance beam. It was ovarian cancer. Joining us today is Shannon Miller and Buffy Swinehart of Aflac to talk about some surprising new survey results that they have. Good morning, ladies. How are you? Good morning. Doing well. Thanks. Shannon, let's talk with you and, and share a little about your story because this is such a, a very touching story and I think a lot of ladies know what you've been through. Absolutely. Well, you know, there I was, an Olympian, a two-time gold medalist, and yet I called up to cancel my doctor's appointment, just a regular exam, because I felt healthy. And luckily, I thought better of it. I went in, and that morning, my doctor found a baseball-sized cyst on my left ovary. And after surgery, I found out that it was ovarian cancer. But they had caught it early. And after an aggressive chemotherapy regimen, I am now 12 years cancer-free. And that's why I'm excited to team up with Aflac uh, to really encourage others to get those wellness exams. Yeah, you, you so great that that's uh, that's happened to you but also what is kind of important you said something that you felt healthy you felt nothing was wrong and you canceled that appointment so were you very surprised when the, they came with this diagnosis I was shocked uh, I I told my doctor I felt fine and yet uh, I was so young and I think that's maybe what shocked me the most I was only 33 years old at diagnosis and at that time cancer ovarian cancer certainly wasn't on my radar I was a new mom I was uh, running my business I was focused on all of these other things a little stomach ache here or there was not going to slow me down and I think that's what I want to stress to people out there is even if you're feeling well go in for those regular appointments because early detection truly can help save lives. Yeah, and Buffy, that's where Aflac comes in because with this results that you have from the survey, it's talking about things that we need to do. Let's talk a little about that. Absolutely. So helping people with cancer is something like really near and dear to our hearts at Aflac. So helping people like Shannon. And we wanted to learn more about how Americans felt about these routine exams and why they might be putting them off or not going. And so we wanted to start a conversation about how early detection can truly save lives. Yeah, I know we're talking, of course, about uh, women, but also men too, we saw there in the video, need to do this. So what else did this uh, survey show us that we need to start doing? So a couple key stats that jumped out to me as we reviewed the survey, one in two Americans are putting off these wellness exams. And that can be for a variety of reasons. It can be busyness, as Shana said, being a new mom. It could be, I don't wanna hear what the doctor has to say, or I feel perfectly healthy. And then the other key statistic that I wanna to highlight today is that 51% of people diagnosed with cancer in the United States, they found that news out at a routine checkup like Shannon. And so, Truly, these, these wellness visits can help save lives. Yeah. Shannon, let's talk about younger people, because, again, you were just 33 years old, and some people think, you know, you get cancer when you, you know, reach your 40s or 50s or something, but we're starting to see it even in younger people. So what are some things you could say to keep these healthy habits going? I would say we all need to focus on our health, including younger people. Uh, we really need to focus on fitness, a balanced diet, but getting to those medical exams, even when we feel good, create that baseline, create that open line of communication with your physician. Uh, be willing to speak up when something doesn't feel right. Uh, go in and get it checked. I think the most important thing to remember is uh, you have to make your health a priority and nudge your friends. friends family members, nudge them a little bit. Sometimes it just takes a reminder to go in and get it done. Yeah, I like what you said right there. Talk with your family. Let them know, you know, too, what's going on and happening. It's so important there. Um, ladies, where can we find more information? To learn more about the survey results, go to aflac.com slash wellnessmatters. Perfect. Ladies, thank you very much for joining us. Thank, thank you. you.